Okay, hello, my student, how are you? I think the problems is easy. The first, how to, to, to solve the problems. First time, you use it in the brackets. When you add 74 plus 36 is 110, right? Divide it by 10 plus five square, it is 24, 25, time what? Time four. When you def now you divide it and you find multiplication. So 110 divided by 10, it is, it is what? It is 11, right? Plus 25 times four, it is 100. So 100 plus 11, it is 111. Yes, it is A. 25 is here. Five square is 25. I bought first find the brackets here, then you find division. Also 25 multiplied by four is 100. 11 plus 100, it is 110. Right. Okay, now we will go to the second one. I want to solve. I give you one minute to solve it. Okay, I am waiting you. Okay, now value of A is five minus fifth divided by five. Also minus five divided over minus fifth. How I solve the problems? When you see here, because not the same denominator, I put it the same. So you can write five divided when minus one over five. All then you can write this also division to multiplication. Multiply by this, the denominator will be when. So when over what? When over five. And I want to put here the same. Five times five, it is 25. Minus when it is 24. Divided by five. And multiply by when over five. So the answer is 24 divided by 25. This is the left one. The second one also you transfer from division minus five over when time. What about this? Also you flip minus five over what? Minus five over, over when? When you multiply minus five times minus five, it is what? 25. So the answer is B. The value of B is greater than the value of A. You must know how to find the answer. Okay, now number three and four will be finished. The uh, math section. Okay, try to solve these problems, my student. Now we want to solve these problems. What is it X here? If you want substitute, you can, yes. You can substitute also to find X. When you write square root of X, you find this number. Is it C? Number three, yes, is it C, right, good. Okay, if how I solve this problem, when you see square root of X, you put it square root here, and you put here square root. Square root of X 
it is x. So we find it x equal. Square root of this, you multiply by two times. Square root of two plus one. You multiply by square root of two plus one because I have two times. Square root of two times square root of two, it is two. Square root of two times one, it is square root of two. Then one time, it is square root of two. And one time when it is when, and you add two plus when it is three, and two square root of two. So the answer is a three plus two square root of two. So the answer is number C. The answer is number C. Okay, no problems. That's, it is, I think it is easy. Okay, be careful, please. Only you square to side. Malak, you square to side. And here also you put square here. You see, square root of x equal to what? Equals x. And you repeat these brackets. You repeat it. Only you multiply two times. Square root of two plus one times square root of two. Then you square the first one and the first term times second term times two will be two square root of two. And one square is one. Then you can add one plus two equals three plus two square root of two. So the answer is number what? Number C. You see? Right. Thank you very much. And you are welcome. We finish now in math section. We will go to the variable section. Bye, my student. Thank you. And you are welcome.